Hello everybody, my name is Parak and welcome back to some more Monster Hunter Stories 2. As you probably noticed, we're not where we were before. Very good reason for that. For whatever reason, my OBS decided to go, Oh, you see how you have your mic setting on? You have it all set up and it's been that way for pretty much two years and you've never changed it. How about this one time that you go to press record, you have all your mic settings set up, except for some reason your mic isn't connected to OBS. Pretty much we lost an hour of footage. That's great. Thanks OBS. Even though I turned it on right now and it's connected. Crazy, right? I'd say you just didn't miss much, but for those that have played Stories 2, you probably know what has happened since we're on a different island. Essentially, the main plot point of the entire game happens, which is you found a little Rathalos egg. I don't know if I can find it. We found the Raisewing Ratha egg or the Rathalos egg. Pretty much a lot of the big point of this entire game is taking care of this Rathalos from what I know. We found the baby egg and we're going to this next village to try and find find out more information about it. That's basically what's happened. We did go through a few fights. It wasn't too impactful of a journey. We went and fought some basic monsters. They really weren't too big of a deal. Also ran past a lot of monsters, so we're probably undergeared or underleveled quite a bit, but it should be pretty fine. I don't think we fought these yet, because obviously we just got here. We may as well fight it. I feel like they're probably... I feel like power. I'm going to go with speed. Easy. Also, there was an immense amount of support on the first video obviously you'll probably saw it there was like i think 20 to 30 comments a few people didn't like the idea of me playing stories a few people really really did like it for example it's like 130 likes at this exact moment when i'm actually recording which is insane the support y'all have shown it has been incredible if y'all want to see another video after this one on stories 2 this video needs to get to 120 likes within 24 hours i'll give you 24 hours if not i'll just go back to playing rise and world obviously i haven't fought this either but for those that did not want to see more of this because they find the game boring i'm gonna try and make it a little bit more enjoyable oh it is speed perfect actually guess correct ow can you not do that again let's uh change to this but for those that don't enjoy the slow pacing in this game because personally myself I also think it's a little bit slow on this because obviously these extra animations and stuff do take a bit of extra time which adds up a lot um, when most like turn-based games are quick and snappy especially when it's like real-time strategy so with a lot of these monsters I'm probably going to show like the counterplay or like bad or good moments where I guess correctly dodge something correctly pretty much anything like eventful inside the combat to kind of speed it up for those that don't enjoy it as well as still giving you guys the game itself also there's going to be a lot less like guide talk throughout these follow-up videos because obviously I was just showing you how the game roughly works to begin with. Yeah, that's pretty much the intro gone. Also, I do plan on making these a bit longer, these videos, because there's obviously a lot of game to go through here, especially if we are, are like grinding up levels and whatnot. It might actually take a while, which I haven't done yet. I haven't grinded up anything. I might have to for the next like major fight, but we'll see. Yeah, see little Rathalos egg. Also, we caught a Bullfango, which is a, a power monster. Which is very, very handy, because now we have a monster we can swap to if we want to do power attacks. Oh, there's a Gargoyle. For example, like these small monsters, you would have seen it in the previous, like, fight. I kind of just delete them. Wait and see. Really? It doesn't anything special, we'll see. Oh. Copied me. At least I'm assuming that's what that was. Can we kill it? Hey, let's go. Oh, I also fought an Anjanath. That was something that happened. It wasn't too scary. Kind of just used like evasion skills since we made a bow. We also made upgrades of each weapon, obviously, because it is Monster Hunter after all. You definitely want to upgrade your stuff as you go. Skip. Uh, I'm so glad you can skip this. I've already watched it through the first time. I like played through a decent chunk of the game. I don't need to see it again. Oh, there's a Palumu up there. Oh, we got uh, this lad on and Legiana. From memory, he's quite strong too. He does like a lot of extra, extra attacks. On most things. Was that an Azros? Azrosi. Right, I imagine this lad's probably power. And the little dude hitting me would be speed again. Yeah, easy. So he is power. Oh, he's angry. Probably changes to speed, I'd imagine. I don't think Azros would be a technical monster. He's also doing something special this turn. So we may as well do a, a ride to see, kind of gauge what we're dealing with. Yeah, I figured he's healing. Okay. Maybe knock him over here? Maybe? Let's go. No healing for you, sir. Assuming he didn't just go down. That was easy. Didn't even get to stand up. The forest of mystery. 
Oh, hello. I forgot about you, Kurapeko. I think he's got like confusion based stuff, so he's probably technical. Just attack him to gauge it because he's not targeting anyone. Song and protection. Okay. And we don't want to use sharp weapons. Got it. I feel like he's a technical monster. Let's try that, shall we? It is technical. Easy money. And he is not weak to bows. That's fine. So we use the hammer. Oh, wow. He died in a stun. Okay. That was easy. Oh, hello, great Roggy. I think. Jaggies. Okay. They're probably... I want to say they're power, actually. I feel like the big one's probably power. I'm going to go with speed. Technical. Okay. I don't need to use power. Ooh. This might be bad. Aye. Maybe I should have grinded a little bit. They're all aiming at me. No one's healing me. We have to heal then. Beautiful. They all took one down. Hopefully this doesn't... Ooh, two health. Let's go. Wasn't even worried. He's not aiming at anyone, so he might attack me. I'm just gonna heal again. Oh, he's summoning more. Okay, he's angry. I'm guessing he changes to powerful then. Let's gauge it out with an evasion, because it's just him. Speed. Okay, so we gotta use technical. Ah, oh, easy. Definitely don't need these either. Although, again, I, I should probably get the experience, because you all saw how hard they were hitting me. But, oh well. Oh, I think we found our Palumu. Survey says... It is Palumu, okay. I feel like you're probably technical. It's also not going for me, so we can actually test it. It is technical, okay. Easy stuff. And it's weak to sharp. Love it. Nope, oh, not targeting someone, so it's a big attack or he's readying up to hurt. I feel like we're probably not going to be able to hit him too well with a sharp weapon. So I'm going to swap to the bow. Also, my dude's already using power, so I don't need to change him. Oh, it's using speed. Okay. I'm glad that Alwyn cancelled that turn then. Because I need to be using technical now, not uh, power. Oh, air showdown. Is this a mashing thing still? I can't remember. I cannot remember. Oh, tap them. Okay, easy. Easy stuff. A little bit more awkward than mashing, but it is what it is. Bonk. Okay, in range, I'm guessing power. He's also not doing anything this turn by the looks, so he can probably just land damage for now. Yeah, he's going back in the air. Okay. So we swap back to technical after this. If he's attacking, let's use the ride to cancel this turn. Just to double check what he's doing. Also aim for the neck pouch. Yeah, but he's back to speed. Go, Bull Drone, get him. Beautiful. Oh, he's down. It was easy as he didn't even do any like special abilities except neck like just flying we did it thank you navarro also get an egg probably a palumu if i had to guess what a wild guess right white egg hey let's go and that's the other egg okay well everybody that was some more monster hunter stories too as i mentioned at the start get this video to 120 likes or more and i'll continue with some monster hunter stories too hopefully those that don't particularly enjoy stories too can enjoy the style that i brought into this there will be more rise and world stuff eventually just enjoying this at the moment as always thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you on the next one